Ah, hey there, everybody. Good morning. Welcome to a Monday morning installment of 7 Minutes in the Morning. My name is Tom Rigsby, your host. How was your weekend? I hope it was fantastic. Mine was pretty good. Happy belated, a belated happy Easter to everybody. Uh, let's see if we can't get the ball rolling here as you get here, just like Joe did. Leave me a comment. Say hi. Let me know that you are here, that you're watching, that you're listening. Whether you're watching on Facebook, listening on iTunes, none of that stuff matters. Just be here. And if you want to comment, participate, you got to come on over to Facebook. All right. So um, the title of today's show is I've Been Busy, and it's not what you think. It's not that I've been busy. It's that we hear very often in response to, hey, man, how you been? Oh, I've been busy. And here's what I want you to do. I want you to think about that for just a minute. Number one, number one question. Do you use that as an answer? When people ask you, how have you been? How are things? What's been going on? Do you respond by saying, I've been busy? If you do, today's show is for you. If you know somebody who responds by saying, I've been busy, then uh, today's show is for them. You need to send them a link to this show so that they can catch the show. I just noticed I'm cutting off the top of my head there with the camera. I must have bumped it while I was handling the wiring. A very wet UK says, Keith, well, hello to you. It, you know, I, I actually had a chance to cut the grass this weekend in spite of all the pollen. This whole thing has kind of been clearing up. And um, so I got out there and cut the ground. I actually had dried out. For the most part, we've had kind of a wet spring here also. All right. So in terms of being busy, <clears throat> here's why I want to encourage you to not use that. I think a lot of times we use that as a crutch. When our answer is, well, I've been busy. And I've even used it. Look, I, you know, for those of you that are going to call me out on it, I'll just go ahead and confess. I have said, now I've been busy, but that's better than the alternative, right? The problem is that we use being busy as a crutch. We can be the hamster running in the wheel is really busy, but he ain't getting anywhere, right? And that's that's the crutch, right? We know, especially for, is it still over my shoulder here? High performance, high achievers. We know that there are things that we need to get done. And some of them are not the things we want to work on. Therefore, well, I really need to finish this new uh, video series, this new program, this chapter of the book, whatever. I'll get to that just as soon as I finish this. And then consequently, we can say, well, I've been really busy. I hadn't been getting, now truth be told, this is the real answer. Well, I've been really busy. I haven't been getting the things done that I need to get done, but I've really been busy. Right? Not all the time, but 99.999% of the time, that's where that answer comes from. Because if you had been making progress and getting things done, that would be your answer. That's what you would be proud of, and that would be your answer. Man, I added three new clients this week. Now, maybe you might you might say, oh, I've been really busy because I've added three new clients this week. Okay, that's the point oh 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 one percent where it's okay, right? But don't use busyness. Don't mistake busyness as success. Don't use it as a measure of success. Don't mistake it for success, right? Remember, success is progress toward a goal. Progress is, or is, success is a result of progress. Progress is movement toward a goal. Okay? Movement toward a goal. You have to be moving and you have to have a goal that you're moving toward. Success is not busy. And the other thing to bear in mind, I haven't hit this. I'll have to bring this up again tomorrow. Success is a state, not a destination. You can move into success and out of success and into success, and into failure, and then back into success. It's a state we move into and out of. That 
zone past the finish line somewhere that we all think is success, that's successful. But that really is just the sum of many small successes. I don't want to take too much away from tomorrow's show. I think that's what we'll talk about tomorrow. So here's your question for the day today. Man, I'm getting in under seven minutes today. Hmm, what else could I talk about? <laughs> here's your question for the day today. How do you answer? How do you answer when people say, how have you been? I want you to think about every time you start to, you open your mouth and start to say, well, I've been busy. <clears throat> Nip it and give them a truthful answer, a real answer. Be honest. Whatever honest is for you. I've been cutting the grass. <laughs> I've been rewiring. Oh, man, that was a nightmare. I've been rewiring here around the computer. Whatever the case might be, just be honest. All right. That's it for today. Thanks for joining me this morning. I'll be back again tomorrow morning with another brand new installment. I think we'll talk about success as a state tomorrow. I think. We'll see. See what happens today. All right? Hey, remember, if you are busy, don't say you've been busy. If you know somebody that says they're busy, send them this show. Get them connected to the community here so they can benefit from it as well. I will appreciate it, and so will they. All right, that's it. Till tomorrow, you guys have a magnificent Monday, and I will talk to you then.